Yeah, we made it. Uh, so we already are on the beach. So woke up early, went to breakfast real quick, and then hopped off the ship, got on a bus, and now we are at the beach. Uh, so we're at a place called Pirate Cove. We got a seat, umbrella. There's a there's a bar over there. There's some food. I think they're like some barbecue food, stuff like that, and the ocean. So yeah, I'm excited to get in the ocean. Yeah, so um, we are just sort of uh, setting up right now, and then I think first thing we're gonna do is get into that ocean and, yeah. and test it out. But we'll let you see how it is. Yeah, and it's also in like a protective water bag thing, yeah. so. Um, but yeah, the water's like crystal clear. It's a little cold, but nice. You get used to it. Yeah, you get used to it. Uh, and the sun's at helping for sure. Uh, and the waves are pretty, are yeah, getting there. Yeah, it's like moving us before talking. <laughs> but yeah, it's really nice. And um, I don't know, we're just gonna kind of chill in here. There's uh, some other water stuff that we might do. Uh, I think Amanda and Jaren are gonna try and do like a, uh, uh, like an inner tube being like uh, trailed by a jet ski, like tubing kind of thing. Um, there's a ropes course or a zip line course or something like that. So there's definitely stuff for us to do. I think we're just gonna relax though. Definitely just one of those feels. But yeah, we'll uh, show you exactly what we do or not do. To Melissa in the ocean. We're about to go meet up with her out there. Back in the ocean with Melissa. Loading along. Yeah, so uh, Jaren and Amanda are on the banana boat right now, so I took a little bit of video of that. So that's about a half an hour ride with a bunch of other people, but they're getting essentially like towed by a boat in the middle of the ocean. It looks really cool. Um, and then there we go. There's, now there's the, no water there. Ha <laughs> ha! Now you can see me. Uh, so yeah, now we're just we're just chilling in, in the ocean, and um, yeah, uh, I might grab some food. Um, I might just hold off until we're back on the boat too, because uh, the food here isn't included. 
So I might just hold off and grab a really late lunch with Melissa and get get some of that free food instead. But yeah, right now, just getting rocked by waves. Alright, so we're back on ship and we're back in the stateroom and we got a little heart. Nice little thank you card. Uh, but yeah, so we are starving, so we are gonna go and uh, get some food. And then I'm gonna try and make some Harry Potter trivia because that is in like 30 minutes. And so that's definitely one of the ones that, one of the ones that I definitely wanna get to. One. So go ahead, write down your answer. Don't shout it out loud yet. So, number one. How many goalposts are there on a Quidditch pitch? How many goalposts are there on a Quidditch pitch? <laughs> Moving on to number two. What birthday does Harry celebrate in the first book? What birthday does Harry celebrate in the first book? Number three, what is used as a primary mean of communication in the wizarding world? What is used as a primary mean of communication in the wizarding world? It's not in my Okay, number four, where was the boa constrictor going when Harry let him out at the zoo? All right, number 20. What three items comprises the Deathly Hollows? What three items comprises the Deathly Hollows? All right, that was your last chance to get at least one right. So hopefully you got one. All right, let's go back to number one more. 12? 14, 15, 16, wow, 17, 18, 19, 20. So you all got all 20. All of you. What's your name? Where are you from? I know, I can't remember. Brayden from Florida. Who else is from Florida? All right, and it's dinner time. And uh, so we've got appetizers. I just got a steak, ale, and cheddar soup. For an appetizer, Melissa. I got the cop salad. Yeah, which actually looks really, really good. That was the other thing I was thinking about getting, but I want to get this soup. All right, now it's dinner time, and so I got uh, country fried chicken uh, with the, you know, got the drumstick over there, some mashed potatoes, and then Melissa got. I got salmon with vegetables and rice. Yep. So, let you know how it is. 
All right, now it's time for the best part, the dessert. So I actually got baked Alaska, uh, which is one of Melissa's favorite things, but she can't have it, so I'm having it for her. Uh, and then she got... I got the same thing that I've got, been getting, but this time it comes with a different sorbet and then the raspberry sorbet with raspberries. Yep. It just kept getting grander and grander. Oh, wait, yep. I don't even have any. Uh, it's right there. Cool. Yep, so we'll go take this out or uh, knock this out and let you know how it is. Hi! So it's a little bit after dinner now. Um, we just got done the last show of the cruise. It was the um, All You Need Is Love uh, show. I think that, I don't know if that's the actual name of it, but. <laughs> it's like something about the world works here, I think is what it's yeah. called. And then after that, they did a medley all about love. Yeah, so it was cool. It, um, they did a presentation of uh, people coming out with their uh, flag for the country that they're originally from and like that for everyone on the cruise. It's a lot of different countries on here. It was really cool. Yeah. Uh, and then like the kids club did a did a little number on on the stage too, which was really cute. Uh, and then yeah, just the um, the, the singing afterwards. Um, and now we are sitting on the Lido deck and about to watch uh, Black Panther uh, Wakanda Forever, uh, but right by the pool. Yeah, just relax and enjoy our last night. Exactly. But we didn't talk about dinner. Yeah, wow. so uh, last night at dinner, um, it was okay. Um, not too bad. Um, the um, steak and cheddar soup was really, really good though. Um, the fried chicken was, the, the drumstick was really good. The thigh, unfortunately, wasn't that great, but the, the drumstick and the mashed potatoes were really good still, too. Uh, and then I got the baked Alaska. That was awesome. Yeah, I'm not that a, looked good. I'm not a huge ice cream person, which is wild to her. Mm -hmm. But Can't um, relate. Yeah, I know. <laughs> but that was it's still really good. Um, and then how was yours? Mine was good. Salmon was cooked a lot better than the night before. Uh, and they went all out with my dessert tonight. It was so funny. Yeah. Yeah, they did a huge cake. Uh, the two different sorbets, yeah, blackberries in yeah. there too. Like, yeah, they went they went all out for yeah. the last night. It was really nice. Um, so, yeah, we're just going to go ahead and relax. Not sure how long we are going to be um, staying up here because, yeah, it's going to be a real early day tomorrow. To, yep. to get off the ship and everything. Um, but yeah, we'll let you know uh, if there's anything else that we end up doing. watching Wakanda forever and then they stopped the movie to say there was an announcement going on and there was no announcement and we're like oh okay it's probably just gonna be there for a little bit and like 15 minutes later it's still there so we're like all right we're just gonna go to bed yeah we did a lap around the ship mm -hmm. looked out into the water we saw another cruise ship mm -hmm. and then we came back here and we also found a little duck we found another little little sailor duck for this one and then I think it was yesterday yeah, or something like that we found we yeah have. superhero duck. So we found two ducks on this trip, yeah. uh, which uh, I think is less than I think it's the least amount of ducks that I found on a ship before. I wasn't really looking though. Yeah, that's, the thing. that's true. We weren't. Yeah, but um, today has been a pretty good day. It was a real nice excursion um, that just kind of came out of the blue yesterday. Um, good dinner, good good night, just nice relaxing last day on the cruise. 
Yeah. It is the last day. Yeah. We do have to go back to reality tomorrow, yeah. which is a bummer, but at least we get to see Dino again. Yep, we're excited for that. Yeah. Um, if you enjoy these cruise vlogs, please watch our other playlists of cruise vlogs mm -hmm. on our trip on the Disney Fantasy. I'll mm -hmm. include that playlist here. Yeah. So, uh, thank you guys so much for coming along on this cruise with us. And uh, we hope to see you on many more trips, whether it be cruises or possibly other trips around the country, possibly later on this year. Uh, and as always, make sure you uh, like these videos, subscribe, and leave us a comment. And let us know how you know uh, everything is, and if you've ever been on any carnival cruises or any cruises in general, uh, and what you like best about them. But. Thank you guys so much, and we will see you next week. Bye.